Today is a bittersweet day for us. Um, gee, one of our brightest interns, Isabel Papp, who we call Isa, is wrapping up her multi-year summer internship with the Islander. I remember when Isa walked in with her mom asking that she wanted to be a journalist and she wanted to intern here. Um, at first I thought that she was being brought here by her ear by her mom and she didn't want to do it and it turns out that she has a tremendous amount of initiative, um, a tremendous amount of creativity, good writer and really good worker. So Isa, I think we're going to miss you. I'll come back. You'll, see You'll me. come back? You'll see me again. Well, that's what you all say, but you're going to be a big shot now a senior and you're going to be going to college soon. So first, how's the last three or four years been? been great. I, I've been extremely fortunate that you've let me stay here and work here and it's been amazing seeing like actual journalists be able to like do their jobs and it's been like incredibly valuable just the experience that I already have just going into like not even like the job market but going into college saying I've done this for four years I know what I'm doing I've seen this happen and I know that this is what I want to you know do for the rest of my life so it's been very valuable. Last year, you did something special in journalism. You want to tell us a little bit about it? Sure. Uh, I was accepted into the summer program for the New York Times, and it was a lot of fun. So you traded us for the New York Times? I, it was two weeks. And How I dare I you? I came back. I, I came back. Okay. And I told you all about it. And I spent two weeks in the summer at the New York Times in New York uh, at Fordham University. And I learned, I, I took a, I, I had another mentor than you for two weeks. And I, I learned a lot and it also, it helped like cement my, my idea of what I wanted to do, but it wasn't as like hands-on experience as it was here, so. What's the biggest memory you take from your time here at the Islander? I would say a couple of weeks ago, Karina's birthday party was so much fun because like we had like, every, like, like normally everyone's not in the office, but then we had so many people and there was food and, and everybody was laughing and like you were talking about work, but like it was just like this air of like, you guys all know what you want to do when you're doing it together and i thought it was amazing i thought it was like a perfect like work relationship and way to be with people and it was great that was the chic planning the fall issue planning meeting wasn't yeah. it? i think it was okay Definitely. well we want to thank you isa you've made a significant contribution if you go to our website on the news.com and and uh, you search for isa pop you can see a lot of her work that she's done there uh, some, you know, repurposing on news, but she also has a lot of interesting uh, original content that she has done, including a commentary on the new uh, COSA. Yes, the COSA bill. COSA bill that uh, was very well read. So thank you, Isa. It's okay. been an absolute pleasure. It's been an honor and for me. And do not forget to come back and say hi. I will hi. not. I will never stop. I will come back for Okay, thank you.